Huck fashions of some kind have been used in the trucking industry for over 20 years. So we really focused on working on the fleets. Could be a Walmart fleet, could be Coca-Cola fleet, could be Budweiser fleet. Really, they're not in the business of owning trucks. They're in the business of moving product. So they're buying a truck that has to be dependable for them. It has to be there. Probably right now we're in 80% of the trucks used uh, on the road in North America. So uh, we've got a lot of, a lot of bolts out there on the road. Uh, holding together uh, some, some really important products. The Huck Bolt has a very good history in the uh, commercial uh, trucking market. We've been used there now since the early 80s in an effort to provide a maintenance-free heavy-duty truck chassis. And it has been proven to, uh, to uh, provide a, 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 a truck frame that does not need periodic retightening of the bolts. When we install a huck bolt, we take it up to about 70% of its tensile. The minimum clamp is typically 70% of the, of the minimum tensile. So if we have a, a, a garbage truck that's loaded up with garbage, it's got a high center of gravity, it's going down a concrete road with a bunch of potholes in it, and it's hitting everything and jarring around, the impact load on the bolt isn't getting close to the yield point. Any up and down movement of that truck frame, which is almost constant, puts that transverse vibration into these bolts, which, is, which was loosening nuts and bolts used in the past. So a lot of the fleets locked onto these huck bolts and uh, saw them as an answer to reduce their maintenance cost. And they also found that uh, if you keep the joint tight, the components of the truck frame last longer. The cross members don't fail as often. The, the, the suspension, the spring hangers, the suspension brackets, they last longer. Imagine if we could sell a tire that they don't have to check tire pressure. Imagine if we could check an oil and put that oil in there that they would never have to check the oil levels. You would know all the time it was full. Well, that's what we have with our fasteners. If I was a fleet owner, I wanted to know that this equipment that I'm buying, these millions and millions of dollars that I have invested in trucks, are held together with the best possible fasteners. And one of the ways to do that is insist that Huck fasteners are used in frames.